At night when I go to bed, I visualize my programs. And make sure that I perform my solo in my head perfectly. Focus on each move. I visualize how I enter the rink and the crowd and the judges and all the stressy points of it. Every morning I get up and I couldn't think of doing anything else. I'm happier on the ice than anywhere else. My name is Tuba Karademir and I'm 24 years old and I'm representing Turkey in the Olympics. Tuba was a very active child. Uh, she was uh, technically climbing to the wall every minute. Uh, between my husband and myself, we couldn't even both of us at the same time hold her hands because she would be flipping around. When the first indoor Olympic skating rink opened in Turkey, daycare manager arranged some sessions for the kids to take them and get them exposed to this new place. From the first day, she was hooked up and people there liked her enthusiasm. They thought she's good, she's doing well. So that's how it all started. You must, must have your family support you because otherwise it would be impossible. I'm really grateful that they're an amazing uh, mom and dad. I'm sorry, you can't pick them. We're a tight-knit family. <laughs> of course, I put pressure on myself because I know everything they've given up. I think I work hard enough, and I think I made them proud. I am Turkish, but I'm also Canadian. I've lived here for now about 13 years of my life. After we moved to Canada, it was hard because we have a close ties with our families. To leave everything behind, leaving the families back, and going to uncertainty, it was a big decision. We never regretted it. Seeing her succeeding and happy on the ice, that was worth it. I decided that the reason I came to Canada was to become a better skater in order to represent my country, which is Turkey. If I represented Canada, it might have been maybe easier financially. If you come from Canada, there's a certain clout that, you know, Canadian figure skaters are known to be amazing, whereas Turkish figure skaters are unknown. I'm the first one that's ever made it to the Olympics for sure. I think Olympics was pretty huge in Torino <laughs> in 2006. It was a bit of a, a rush for me to go there. And I actually got to carry the flag for Turkey, which was really, really cool. I hope to be in the top 10. I think I'm very capable of that if I do my programs. Results we can't control. I can't control what other people do. I just want to make sure that I do two clean solos and, um, you know, do something that I'm proud of.